everybody out there on YouTube. Let's double down reviews with another review. Today we are looking at Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 Yondu. Oh, and he yeah. looks scoff. He looks sweet. Uh, packaging, same thing as uh, kind of like the Star Lord uh, Guardians packaging. Um, they all kind of look like this. Kind of yeah, like they theme. all have the speaker. Uh, it's supposed to be like an amp or a stereo. It has like all the knobs and all that stuff. It has your all your little buttons, dials up on top, and then the back of the box looks like the back of a old stereo. It's like black with some credits on there. Uh, the inside insert has the awesome mixtape. So when it's in the window, uh, okay, it's like that. Ta -da! Looks pretty cool. They also got all the little stickers on the sides. The Guardian sticker. He's got the the Ravager symbol. Big volume knob that's cranked all the way to 11. Um, first impressions. This figure looks amazing. Um, yeah. Awesome likeness on this. Figure looks awesome. Um, came with a, I mean, not a ton of accessories, but it's Yondu, and you know exactly what he's doing. Uh, he's Whistling right here, he's got his little arrow flying out, his little red wispies. Does that actually come out of his holster? Yep. It goes it right sits in there? Like, yeah. just plugs into it? Yeah, it just goes in like that. It kind cool. of swirls around, and it is also, you can take it apart if you don't want to display it that way. Um, I've seen people kind of display it where it's just like the arrow is shooting out of his holster like that, and he's kind of like pointing it, whatever. Uh, he came with that. He also came with just his normal arrow that goes right down into his holster, like so. And then this little flap goes around it like that, like holds it in place. Mm. Um, he came with his big fin from Guardians 2. Otherwise, there's just a magnet on here. You can switch that out to have the fin from Guardians 1. Uh, we'll get some close-up shots, show you guys uh, just how awesome the accessories all look. I mean, even look at the inside of this thing. Didn't skip yeah. out. No reason that that needed to be done. Yeah. But. There's tons of detail on everything. Um, his coat, his his costume looks great. Uh, tons of detail on all that stuff. All of his buckles, the designs, and the leather. Um, I believe he even has, yep, he's got the big Ravager patch on the chest. Uh, he's got a big heavy duty coat with wire frames in it, so you can have your like spark blowing the cape away. Dramatic pose. He's just like. Coat blown around. He ain't your daddy boy. <laughs> um, all those little straps on here and yeah. buckles. Those are awesome. And even he's even got like little extra arrows or something up here mm -hmm. on his shoulder blade. What What's cool about this figure also is that oh he also has a knife that goes up here that I didn't even know was a thing, but it is. This comes out. Yeah, up, somehow. It does because I had to put it in there. Um, Hidden blade. Another cool thing about it is how well they got the paint down, like. I've, that was one of the reasons I wanted this, is because most of my hot toys are humans. And this guy just stands out being this bright blue, uh, fantastical character. Yeah, he looks awesome on the shelf. He do. Plus it's Michael Rooker. Michael Effin Rooker. Um, every Guardians 2 figure also comes with a different baby Groot. This baby Groot is squatting down, stretching his arms out. Little attack mode. He's screaming. got his little jumpsuit on. Um, yeah, this figure just looks great, though. I mean, tons and tons of detail in the fabric, the clothing, the paint job. And everything sits nice, too. Like, he's got yeah, multiple layers Nothing's on. bulky. I mean, he's got his big scarf thing on. He's got his overcoat, all of his belts. Um, they did a boot cut on him, also, so he has full... Ankle articulation. Ankle articulation. Um, he's not hindered at all yeah. articulation wise. I mean, you can like all of his major joints have like cloth clothing over them. So, yeah. I mean, he looks super, super awesome. If you're a fan of Guardians, you're a fan of Marvel, you like Michael Rooker, pick it up. I don't care. Definitely the Michael Rooker. Get it. Um, we'll give you some close ups, show you how, how good this figure looks. It's, it's nuts. <laughs> Comes with the stand, his three piece flying arrow, a Groot with the stand, his double head pieces, and what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven extra hands? 
Seven extra hands. So nine hands total. Yep. Nine hands total for different poses. I personally like him with the big fin, because it's kind of like uh, his fin in the comics. Yeah, it's a throwback. Just that huge, huge fin. Um, yeah. Looks amazing, and I love every second of it. Even the scarring that's like on the side of his head. Yeah, that looks sweet. It's all there. They did an awesome job. Amazing figure. Yeah. Um, this is all cast like a translucent also. Let's see. see through the little arrow trail. Uh, this guy's retail was two twenty seven ninety nine, if I remember correctly. Um, there was a deluxe version you could get of him that was I think two two fifty four, I think. Um, it just it didn't seem worth it to me. It came with like a little cage, I think, for like Groot and uh, the metal jetpack piece that goes over his chest. Oh yeah, the jet. Oh, it's like the whole harness, right? Yeah. And just the front and back. Yeah. It just kind of like clips together around yeah. them. Um, it's rather than do a whistling head sculpt also. I Yeah, I thought about that too. Just like him kind of like perch lips, ready to go. Yeah. Ready to whistle. Um, but yeah, no, great, great figure. Tons of detail. I mean, even look at like the... How they did like the fabric and stuff for his scarf has all the little details. Did you in have there. to put this on or was it on? It was on. There. Okay. Yeah, it's like a whole pattern on. I don't the mess scarf with that. Yeah. Sweet looking figure. Um, he's got full blown articulation. He's got shoulders, elbows, uh, standard hot toys with the ball joint and the wrist. Um, he's got a full head sculpt now with the neck cut. And like I said, that's just a magnet. So how well does the magnet stay on? Like if you turn him upside down, does it hold? It ain't going nowhere. Hey. It ain't going nowhere. He's got uh, waist, mid torso. Um, I guess that'd be the one part of him that's hindered. Hindered would be he can't be he's doing the split, the crotch. But that's fine because he's not going to be doing it. Um, you got movement to like that, but that's fine. Knee joints. Knee joints. And then you have your ankle ball, like I said before. So uh, all the posing that you could ever need for Yandu. Um, if you find a one-six scale uh, umbrella, let me know, because it'd be really awesome to have them like that. Boop. And uh, we'll get some close-up shots, show you uh, all the detail and intricacies in the costume and the paint job. Um, if you're a fan of Guardians, pick it up. It's a great figure. Um, since he is so great, how many Henry portraits of a serial killer would you give this <laughs> out of ten? <laughs> Michael <laughs> Rooker. If you know Michael Rooker, you Henry know Henry portrait of a serial killer. Uh, I would give it ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. This is ten Henrys. This is one of the best hot toys I've ever seen. I agree. The paint it's job, amazing. the sculpt, everything is there. We've I mean, had some good ones this year. Look at Yandu. The Volume Two Star Lord was amazing. The mm -hmm. Jack Sparrow was amazing. We've had some really good stuff from them this year. But I mean, like, look at the... Oh my god. <laughs> this thing comes right off. <laughs> look at uh, the, like, goatee on him, even. Yeah. It's like, you can see, like, every little hair on his chin. Yeah. On his chinny chin chin. That's Michael Rooker, all right. Awesome sculpt, awesome paint job. Clothes, costume, everything. It's all there. A little Groot. Looks it's amazing. Cool flying arrow. Amazing! Uh, you have any questions, comments, or let us know what you guys think of the figure. Make sure to throw it in there. Let us know. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe. Um, we'll give you some close-ups and show you guys uh, just how awesome this figure really is. It's my pop, y'all.